good YouTube man, it's your boy Bo back with another motherfucking lit video, y'all. Uh, uh. That's ain't fake, homie a snake, that nigga ain't real, I can't relate Lord, you know, that nigga a hoe, he want the clout, probably sold his soul I swear they throw some dirt on my name, nigga but the fuck with rhyming and chain That ain't the play of the bed for the game, besides bullshit I can't complain Hey man, what's poppin' with y'all young boys, dawg, man It's good to be back, man, and I'm coming back with a motherfucking Hey, bam! You know what I'm saying, cuz? We got the Air Jordan 1 fearless in this thing, man. These niggas are just some heat, fire, and some flames, bro. Honestly, dog, before I got them in hand, I was like, I didn't think I would like them that much. I'm not a huge fan of patent leather, bro. I feel like this shoe would've been way, way better if they just had a game with that regular shot of backboard leather all across the board, man. That red, white, and blue mesh would've been fucking perfect. But the shoe still came out really, really dope, bro. And I didn't know that it had this gold Air Jordan symbol, like, right here, man. Anyways, bro, we'll dive more into the shoe later, bro. But y'all already know what the fuck going on, man. We gotta go and hop into the box. Let go. Let get. All right, y'all, man. Diving into the box, bro. Here we go, bro. We got the Air Jordan 1 Fearless, man. I like how they package this box, yo. Usually, you know what I'm saying? Of course, you get that black Nike box. It looks like they did it inverted this time, man. I think it's really, really dope, bro. Zooming in on the side tag, man. We got the Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG Fearless retailing for 160 of them. Thanks, shawty. Under the lid, man. Oh. Under the lid, man. Doesn't seem to be any type of number code up in there, man. I like this paper, though, man. On the paper, it reads, limits like fear are often just an illusion. Really, really dope going all across the paper, man. Inside the box, man, comes with extra laces. You get blue and red and white that was attached to the other sneaker. Uh, looks like it gives you a card. Limits like fears are often just an illusion, man. Really, really dope, bro. On the back of it, fear scratched out. Just a dope card, man. Other than that, paper inside of the box. Nothing else going on too crazy inside that box. Diving into the sneaker, man. They are just some heat, fire, and some flames, bruh. You know what I'm saying? This patent really came out super, super dope on this sneaker, man. I honestly, I, I'm pretty shocked. I'm not gonna cap. I am very, very shocked. I hate patting on shoes, man. But this was just a phenomenal combination, bro. What Jordan Brand did with this. Oh, and on the back of the tag, it says, limits like fears are often just illusion. Again, I love, love, love when Jordan Brand comes out with dope sneakers like this, man. And on the bottom, man, you just got that red bottom there. White mid, so super, super dope sneaker, man. Looks like it's gonna go with a lot of clothing but you gotta watch what you rock with it man because that patent man it ain't like just regular leather man you gotta <laughs> you gotta be careful on how you rock these joints dog inside the sneaker oh and you get black laces as well damn boy jordan hooked us up man i'm surprised they ain't throw us with a loop man and charged us 175 for these joints man and on the sole of the sneaker man you got fear crossed out and then again that same tag uh this is super dope man this concept is really really fire man and it looks like they changed up the size tag in a little bit too man side tag looks a little different now man it looks like they're upgrading on it but honestly y'all man the sneaker man it speaks for itself you know what i'm saying there's not there's nothing really to go into too much detail about this sneaker so i'm gonna just go ahead and give y'all what y'all really came here to see man that crispy on foot 4k 360 review of the sneaker, man. Gang. Yeah. Damn! You know what I'm saying? Cause these joints are super, super fire. And the only thing about them, y'all, is that, bro, you really cannot, like, scrape this patent up, man. You gotta be careful, bro. And also, I feel like they're gonna be Cree City, you know what I'm saying? Uh, with the toes being, I feel like, in this area. And I feel like in the rear, around this area, it's gonna be Cree City, man. But that's okay. Just hit the foot locker, man, and get you some crease protectors. You should be good. Keep them laced up pretty good. You should be all right, man. But these joints are super, super fire. Personally, in my humble opinion, I'm going to rate them a 9 out of 10. The only reason why I don't give them that good 10 out of 10, bro, is because it's not like it's that patent leather. I hate patent leather, but this combination came out pretty, pretty dope. But if it was just regular leather, it, we don't even, they didn't even have to give us a shot of that boy. It would have been on point. But without all this talking,
is it, guys, man. I really hope y'all enjoyed it. You feel me? Make sure y'all smash that like button if you thought this video was helpful or entertaining in any form or fashion. And if you fucking with the kid, if you fucking with the energy, and if you fucking with the swag, you know what I'm saying, cuz? Cause we having a whole lot of sauce over here, dog. Make sure y'all smash that subscription button and y'all smash that notification bell so you never miss another little video. You know what I'm saying, bro? It feels good to be back. I'm back with the consistency, man. We on point, man. I just did a live stream today, man. Make sure y'all tune into the live streams, bro. Whenever there's a lit sneaker coming out, guarantee that I will be doing a live stream for that sneaker, man. So make sure that y'all keep the post notifications on. I fuck with y'all for fucking with me, man.